What's up guys, Alec here and today I'm going to be showing you why you want to be posting more carousel posts rather than one photo or one video posts. So on Instagram, the more engagement you get, the better your post performs and the better your post performs, the more engagement you get. And a great way to get more engagement and reach on your post is to make a carousel post, but why? Now before I jump right into that, I'm just going to make sure you know what a carousel post is. It has multiple photos or videos in the same post and each one of these pieces of content within that post have to be the same dimensions. So if you're posting portrait content, all of the content within that carousel post has to be portrait. If it's landscape, it all has to be landscape. So yes, now I've said that, you want to be posting carousel posts and why? The reason being is that when you post a carousel post and someone scrolls and sees it on your feed, they don't necessarily swipe through to the next one and they might not necessarily like that post. When they leave Instagram, quit it and come back to it later, They'll scroll through their feed and then Instagram, the clever app that it is, will show them the second post of that carousel post if they didn't swipe and see it. And because they didn't like this post the first time, Instagram is showing them the second slide of this post so they're seeing it again and they're more likely to like it because they're seeing it for a second time round. Now if this was a normal one photo post, someone would scroll through it, see it on their feed, not necessarily like it, and once they've seen it, they've seen it. They're just going to keep scrolling and then... They'll leave the Instagram app and they'll come back to the Instagram app and the Instagram algorithm is going to place that post at the bottom of the user's timeline because they've already seen it. This is why the Instagram algorithm is so clever. It shows people a post if they haven't seen all the content within that post. And the way that someone doesn't see all the content within a post is if it's a carousel post. So post more carousel posts because they get more likes and engagement. And just to prove you this, I'm going to take a look at the posts on my profile. Okay, so now I'm on my profile, I'm going to be comparing normal posts to carousel posts. So first of all, I'm just going to have a look at a single post. You can see here I've got 202 likes. If I go to this carousel post, 231 likes, the carousel post has got more. Another single post, I got 210 likes. Um, and I got a text there, just swipe that off. Carousel post here, you can see I got 238 likes, which is really good for me. Um, here I got 213, which is less. Um, let's have a look. Carousel post again. I got 244 on this one, which is really high when it comes to me. Um, this one, I got 184. And, and as you can see, look, another, another single one, 183. So you can just, just see, like from my profile, as an example, that carousel posts get more engagement and likes. And that's just because they're showing up a second time in the timeline to all your followers because they're not probably swiping through. So they see them more, they look at them longer, they're more likely to like them, they're more likely to comment them when they see them for a second time. So start creating carousel posts. So yeah, that's the video for today, guys. Let me know what you think of this trick to boost your Instagram engagement. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. I wanna hear all of your thoughts, questions, comments in the comment section below. If you wanna see more of these, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Alec Wilcock. And again, guys, thanks for watching. Peace out. It's just another Hollywood weekend That was an energetic piece out. I felt that one. I'm, I've got the energy for making these videos again.